damn, this TV's getting pretty boring. Yeah, it really is. You know what? I got an idea. What's your idea? Alright, so, my plan is that we go on Craigslist, Marketplace, whatever. We try to find the cheapest car as possible, and we do a cheap car challenge, and just see who wins, you know? Just destroy a car, why not? Two cars. Alright, alright, I think I have a car in mind. Alright, let me pull up my phone and see what we got here. Alright, I just, um, we just made it plans. We're gonna go pick up the, well, I'm gonna go pick up that car. I just found a car and it's pretty, um, well, I don't know condition. He said it's really bad, but, um, I'm buying it sight unseen, basically. You got anything? Uh, yeah, I actually got a pretty good vehicle. Uh, not, it's, it's actually pretty good for the price. Alright, well, um, you made plans with him. You go and pick it up? Yep. I'll see you if when we get back. Yep. Alright, let's um let's go and pick up these vehicles. We're going basically over to um the grapeseed area. Well basically where we are now except it's a little further. I think I know where it is. Basically this car is like an extremely abandoned vehicle. Can I get my trailer? There we go. So yeah, this thing is really abandoned apparently, and I, I think I know where it is, so if I make like a wrong turn or something, I don't 100% know where it is, but I got the general idea of where it is. The guy said, basically, I can have it for literally 200 bucks, so I guess it's in really bad shape, but it does run. I don't know if it drives, so that's a little bit of a problem, but um, hopefully it does drive, and yeah. Because obviously, at 200 bucks for a vehicle, that's literally nothing. That's dirt cheap. But, uh, yeah. Getting this thing for a pretty good deal. I Like I said, sight unseen. Never seen it, so. Hopefully we don't get pulled over when we end up driving these things. I don't know what his looks like. I don't know what mine looks like, so. <laughs> I assume mine's extremely... Not even world legal because two hundred bucks gets me nothing apparently. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm just gonna be cruising for a while, trying to get over there. I think we're getting pretty close now, the dirt road to turn but I think it's up here somewhere. Uh yeah, it looks like it's right there. I think this is the road to go on. Oh yeah, I think I see that that barn. I think that's where we need to go. I think, anyways. I am going the wrong way, I think, but that's fine. Let's go to the back side, I guess. Wow, am I really not making it up this hill? It's full full throttle. All right, well, so I'm just gonna pull into the barn here if I can. Oh god, white turn. Oh, just scra scrape the barn a little bit, that's all good. Alright, I'm just gonna kind of pull up here. So, um, I see something over there. Okay, that's... That's an El Camino, I don't think this is what I'm buying. Although that is pretty nice, minus the, um, the graffiti. And the... Kids and their graffiti, graffiti just ruin cars. Come on, like that's that's a nice clean El Camino. Um, our vehicle's got to be somewhere. Like, is it outside? It's over here. The guy basically just said the keys are in it and just leave the two hundred bucks anywhere. I'll just probably put it on the El Camino. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Well. <laughs> uh, yeah. I would say it's pretty B. <laughs> oh, man. Um, alright, well. I'm gonna hop in it and hopefully it fires up. Like the guy said. Alright, it started. Now, question is, does it drive? 
Okay, it does drive, and I'm scraping on the wall. What, what happened to this thing? It looks like it got ran over by Monster Max. <laughs> the banana. Oh god. I'm gonna just quickly cut through the grass. This thing... Looks like it was in World War II. God. <laughs> Uh, pull it up over here behind the trailer. Uh, it's just that's good enough. Well, I'm gonna put the money. Actually, I wonder if the El Camino is open. I can just throw it inside. What was that? <laughs> that like murder a rat nest or something? Anyway, I'm just gonna leave the money here. There we go. I'll just um, message him and let him know that the money's in the El Camino. And, um, let's get this thing all nice and loaded up real quick. This is a bit of a pain to load up. Um, I kept getting stuck on the ramps because this thing is literally bolted in half. But uh, we got it on. May have popped the tire. Seems like a little bit. Should be fine. Um, let me go ahead and strap it down real quick. Um, seems nice and secure. Uh, well, I guess <laughs> this thing's it. Let's go ahead and take this thing back. And yeah, I guess this is our car. Oh man. Let's go ahead and drive this thing back now. I wonder what the police are going to think when we're driving these things down the road. Oh, what? <laughs> Birds just straight up flew into my trailer. Um, my bad. Alright. It's just time to drive back now. Pull in. I'm so curious to see what he got. I feel like it can't compete with what I got, though. <laughs> um. Let's just park it in the middle of the road for now. Alright, oh I see what you got. <laughs> yeah, I got Buick uh, Rivera. You got... It's I got a... Um, on itself. Yeah, I got a bent Cadillac. It looks like Monster Max ran it over. That's what I said. I made that reference. <laughs> it looks like it was in World War II. <laughs> that's, that's great. Yours has definitely got a lot of rust. Yeah, mine It's got some is... nice rims and exhaust on it, though. It looks like someone was in the middle of restoring it. Yeah... But, uh, how much did you pay for yours? Uh, only a thousand dollars, surprisingly. <laughs> you want to know what I paid for mine? What? <laughs> I paid 200 bucks for mine. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, I also saw this nice, um, it's actually pretty clean. There was a, a pretty clean, uh, El Camino in the barn. Oh. Mine was basically outside of the barn, but I just left the money in there, and I, I gotta text him and let him know that. But, uh, I think we should, um, sleep for the night, and then... Do our activities tomorrow. Yep. Let's go in. All right, guys. Next morning, we uh we unloaded the cars last night before we went to bed. Forgot about that, so we just kind of had to do it real quick. And um, here are the beautiful vehicles. <laughs> here we got yep. the tetanus mobile, <laughs> <laughs> and then I got the uh the banana over here, looking pretty banana. And, uh, let's just, I guess, get to beating these cars up. <laughs> Have, uh, did I forget to, I forgot to tell you something. Uh, this thing has a stock, uh, rebuild motor in it. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, so you're cheating. <laughs> you got, you got more power. I guess. 
I also haven't tested if all the gears work on this thing or reverse. So if I don't have reverse, that's gonna be a problem. But you know. Yeah, that's the one thing you cannot replace in like internals is transmission as well. Yeah, it's it's fine. Who needs reverse? Am I right? Yeah. Oh yeah, let's go full throttle on this bad boy. Oh yeah, all of the speed. This thing actually gets him going. Holy crap! Just running the stop. It's fine. Fine. We're not putting anyone in danger. <laughs> it's not like you're putting yourself in danger with that banana of a vehicle. Nah, it's fine. It decides to just like kind of run off the road every once in a while. I I couldn't tell you why. The frame's definitely not bent in all sorts of ways, you know? Yep. This car needs to go faster. <laughs> I can't realize how many headlights I have in this thing. Yes, he's turning the other direction. Can I do a burnout? Oh, yes! Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna try to do one. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm gonna go full throttle. Full speed. Let's go. Oh, this is this is disappointing. Oh, there we go. She's got a little bit of top end. Okay, that car is. I almost hit the back of you. Well, um, don't do that. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna slow down a little bit. I'm not concerned about the car. I'm just more concerned about our health. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah. yeah, it wasn't me. Just, just keep going. Nothing happened. You didn't see anything. It's fine. I mean, I'm surprised your vehicle hasn't snapped over that, but sure. Yeah, I was expecting this thing just to snap first time taking it on the road. Just like a little bump. This thing just splits in half. So how far are we going in these things? As far as they go. <laughs> okay, so get a full tank. Got it. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. It's basically half tank. I just wanted to make sure that I have enough fuel just in case I puncture the gas tank or something. <laughs> Knowing the gas tank's full of rust. Um, that's a high probability. <laughs> this thing is... The best vehicle you could ever ask for. Yes. I'm gonna see if I can do a standing burnout. Uh, you, you get some hunger. <laughs> yep. Alright, let's see if I can do a standing burnout. Maybe not next to the gas pumps, because that's smart. This thing might catch on fire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright. Oh, no, it, it's not, it, it doesn't, wait, oh, come on, yeah, there we go, there you go. <laughs> this so thing has got no issue. power, I think it's uh, got lack of power and clutch issue, which don't go well together, <laughs> yeah, alright, let's just like floor it down this road, Maybe get some jumps going and sma snap my car in half. <laughs> Surprisingly for, um, um, what is it called, dry rod tires, this thing gets some grip. This thing is not the worst. Oh, God. How did my frame not just snap in half? Oh, wolf. <laughs> it might not be even snapped. It might be just bent. I think it's about right to snap, but I would not be surprised if it just snaps any time and... I just leave half the car behind me. <laughs> yeah. Oh. I'm scared for, like, any little jump. I'm concerned this thing's just gonna explode. <laughs> it's just gonna collapse and leave me stranded. I'm curious. Is the e does the e-brake work? Um. Here. Oh! Okay, no. Okay, sure. Here, just go ahead and, um slam on the brakes real quick. I'm going to test the E-brake. Alright. Yep, it, um, it works. <laughs> uh, I was expecting the E-brake not to work, like it was snapped or something. <laughs> Alright, this might snap my frame. Oh god. Okay, it didn't. Good. I'm just so concerned. Like, a little bump's probably just going to break this thing. I just realized this, this thing has a red mirror. <laughs> Did you uh, check out the frame on that thing, or do you not just care? You just kind of bought it? Um, it, it's just, it's not terrible, like, compared to yours at least, but it's not like it's going to, like, be roadworthy enough. Yeah, I mean, you're talking to me, and this thing's, um, you know, it's, it's it, you know. 
It's its own thing. <laughs> oh, we're going down here, I see. Yeah, we're going to do some off-roading and maybe a little bit of mudding. See if we can get stuck. <laughs> yeah. I'm honestly going to be happy if I abandon this thing. I don't want it. <laughs> I mean, you only paid $200, right? Yeah. Yeah. Excuse me, animals. Oh, God. That moose almost ran into me. Deer, moose, whatever it was. Surprisingly, so far, this thing did not explode, which is a surprise to me. Oh, God. We're, 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 whoa, oversteer. Oh, I didn't know other people really drove on this road. <laughs> I didn't know either. I almost wrecked it, by the way. I oversteered it. <laughs> almost crashes. Yeah. Get a little bit of off-roading going. Oh, excuse me, Mr. Fan. I'm curious what's under the hood. I didn't even look what's under the hood. You just said it has a rebuilt motor and that's it. Yeah, I didn't look either. I'm assuming this thing just has a rat nest for a, <laughs> a motor. <laughs> so I yeah. won't be surprised if it catches on fire. <laughs> it's really a rat nest in the air filter knowing as well. Most likely. It's probably just sucking up nest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Or a rat. <laughs> just a rat in the air filter. Just sucks up a rat. Alright, let's... Oh, I can't drift this thing. Here. Alright, I'm gonna I'm go through some water there. here. Oh, that looks safe. Alright, surprisingly, my frame did not just snap there. Yep. Surprised these things haven't, like, had a hydro lock issue yet. <laughs> and oh. now they're going through it. That's oh, a pull. I just busted a headlight. You don't need those, those are useless. Oh, this thing does not get grip up here. <laughs> Just sliding back there. Oh, I broke another headlight. How am I breaking my headlights? Come on, you need them. <laughs> I I really do, especially with it getting slightly like darker and eh, it's morning, I guess. I don't know what time it is. Just cloudy. Uh Woohoo. <laughs> There's bumps. Yep, yeah, there is. Oh god. See, this thing can basically be a boat. <laughs> this is risky. Uh, yeah, the risk was in on that one. Wait, I made that? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Your engine has an hydro lock over <laughs> What? I don't feel like going across that. Yeah, um, I wouldn't either, but I did. And I'm not oh. let down. What? I just realized something. You, I can't get back across. That and my wheel has concave. It is like caved in itself. Does it still drive? <laughs> it's my front wheel, so yeah. All right. Well, I guess just keep going. <laughs> uh, might as well. All right, here I go. I'm surprised this thing has not drowned yet, considering the whole car went underwater. Yep, same here. Oh, you made it. <laughs> Where are you? I, I went right. Alright. Yeah, you really can't see these little cars when it's in the bushes. Yeah. I went oh, right you're over there. You. Hold up. Whatever. Alright. Oh, here. Oh, hey, how you doing? Don't wreck into me. <laughs> I thought you were going straight before me. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna head up this hill. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What? Oh god. The car's done. What happened? Oh, I rolled it. How did you roll it? <laughs> Are you okay? The suspension failed. It caved in itself and then rolled. Oh, oh god. Dang. You see? <laughs> oh, do I really have to hop in this piece of junk? Uh... Maybe. <laughs> oh, dang. You know what? If we bring this home, I have an idea what we should do for this. My car or yours? Yours. We're, I'm just gonna ditch that car. Yeah, I ripped the door off. <laughs> you didn't need that anyway. Cosmetics. Yeah. You know, right. let's reinforce the frame like this. And let's put a... Don't do that! Oh, God. Let's reinforce the frame like... Like, just so it's, like, sitting like this. And let's put a diesel in it. You know, just 
<laughs> yeah, just keep the, the banana and just put a turbo diesel in it. Yeah. Yeah, let's do it. Just put like a Cummins in it. Yep. Oh god. That's I'm a little concerning. Snap. Yeah, me too. I I'm just expecting it to snap in half and then we just lose our other halves. Yep. Alright, well, um So far this thing's handling really well. Yeah. Well, are you ready to go back? I guess. I mean you won the challenge. Yeah, I guess so. I just wanna see if I can kinda of destroy the car to be honest. <laughs> yep. Alright, well let's just keep going. Oh god. Yep. Don't roll it or do anything to it. <laughs> nah, it's fine. Just looking deep. No, it's fine. Wait, don't um, have to get over. I don't have brakes. I don't have brakes. I don't have brakes. Oh. Um Yeah, brakes kinda said no. <laughs> the run? Oh yeah, it's still okay, moving. Good. Okay, good. Well, we alrighty then. <laughs> um, noted. No brakes anymore. Yep. So good luck stopping. I think I probably broke a brake line somewhere. Um. What? I no longer have drive. I think the oh, clutch burnt out. Oh, that's great. So we have to walk. Yep, I guess I guess we gotta come back with the goose next later. Man. Oh, great. All right. Well, um, oh, I'm stuck. this thing is parked in the worst position ever. It's stuck in this like oh, mud man. ditch. That's probably gonna be filled with uh with water later if it high tides. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, um. This is the end of the video, guys. Um, real quick, I want to make an announcement. If you are looking for a 5M server, this server that we are playing on right now is brand new. Literally no players, just me and my friend Raccoon here. And yep. we've been developing it for a while now. We've put hours into the server and lots of time and money into it. And um, if you guys want to join, feel free. Bring your friends. It'll be a great time. I just wanted to put that out at the end of the video because, uh, you know, more people, police, stuff like that, make better roleplay and better videos in general, because I plan on making a few videos on this channel. And, yep. uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little uh, 5M skit video roleplay, I guess. Um, kind of just threw something together real quick to make a little announcement on the server. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and... Join down below, there's going to be a link to the Discord, and I will see you guys later.